Hi friends, welcome to my channel Kitchen to Kitchen. Today I'm going to share with you an amazing chicken appetizer or starter recipe that I had in Patni Top in Kashmir. Having this dish in your houseboat with cold outside and warm inside, it was absolutely heavenly. Hope you like it. Let's see how to make it. We are using about 300 grams of boneless chicken, so add some salt, 2 teaspoons of red chili powder, 2 teaspoons of garam masala powder, 3 teaspoons of yogurt and I am using hung curd that gives really nice taste, 3 teaspoons of coarse ginger and garlic paste and I am squeezing about half a lemon so 2 to 3 teaspoons of lemon juice. Mix everything really well. I have cut the chicken pieces into small size. You can make them a little medium size as well. Now we are going to let it marinate for about 30 minutes. In a pan add about 3 to 4 tablespoons of cooking oil and once it's hot add about a medium size onion. Flame is on the medium high. We are going to fry the onions on a medium high flame for about 3 to 5 minutes. And soon you'll notice that they start to turn a little translucent and kind of caramelized on some sides. At this point add about a teaspoon of Kashmiri chili powder. Mix well and fry for another 2-3 to three minutes. Kashmiri chili powder gives a nice red texture to this dish. Once the onions are fried add the marinated boneless chicken. Mix it well. Soon enough you'll notice a nice aroma coming from the pan as it fries. The chicken is mixed well. Now we are going to cover and cook it for 8 to 10 minutes on a medium flame. After about 10 minutes, open and check. Notice that there is water released, so give it a quick stir. This dish is absolutely yummy. Cover and cook it for another 5 to 7 minutes on a medium flame. After about 7 minutes, open and give it a stir. The chicken needs to be cooked a little more so cover for another 3 to 5 minutes. After about 5 minutes let's open and notice that the water is pretty much you know evaporated. The chicken has also become a little soft. Now let's check that it's cooked well. So with the help of a spoon I'm just going to make sure break it and see and it does. So it's cooked well. We are going to now add the kasuri methi or the fenugreek leaves. So crush them and then sprinkle them over the chicken. Give it a good mix. Kasuri methi is one of the main ingredients in this recipe. It gives a nice delicious taste to the recipe. Garnish with some coriander leaves and switch off the flame. Kasuri methi chicken is ready. Serve it hot. This is an amazing appetizer or starter recipe that goes really well with your drinks or even as a side dish with your main course. Just yummy by itself and absolutely delicious. Hope you've enjoyed today's recipe. Please don't forget to like, subscribe and comment. Thank you.